The SBE program means the Small Business Enterprise Program, and it is a race and gender neutral program that Pinellas County has implemented to help diversify our supply chain by utilizing small businesses to help us procure our goods and services. We're out here at Sand Key Park on a construction project, a pretty big project as you can see, lots of paving and drainage and roadway work going on. We have around, uh, we have around six projects uh, with Pinellas County right now. And this project for the Sand Key project, we're doing, uh, we're fixing the bad roads and we're putting new curb. A small business may also contribute by performing public outreach, tasks such as cores into the pavement, laying out the plans and the design, producing the bid contract documents for a project such as this paving project. It's a success to Luis and his his business. He, he started out small. He's a pretty good sized prime now. He also employs uh, small businesses out here also. I get excited because I know in 2018 when we started this journey to re-engineer the program, we had about 41 vendors in our database. And as of today, we have over 715 vendors in our database. Not only do we have vendors, we are actually awarding contracts. For my uh, business to be awarded a contract is huge, especially being a small business and starting out. It allows us to not only scale our business, but it allows us to employ people. The current projects that I have, one with the Pinellas County, also the City of St. Pete and Tampa Airport. In 2019, we awarded over $7.5 million in contracts. And I'm so proud to announce that in 2020, although we had a pandemic and we had to all pivot, Pinellas County awarded over $20 million in contracts to small businesses. It's important to create opportunities for smaller firms because they're really the backbone of everything we have. Uh, everyone really starts from a small firm. Even the biggest firms start from small. Creative Contractors started over 45 years ago. We started out as a small firm just doing storefront renovations. We understand what it takes for a small company to start and grow over time. We seek out trying to help smaller businesses, so our success is dependent on all the companies that help us. We found with small firms uh, we're able to share the wealth. The SBE Collaborative is a group of professionals from the area. Most of us are in procurement or economic development or supplier diversity, and we get together and share information and best practices to enhance and grow and support the SBE community in the region. One of the things I like most about my experience at the SBDC so far is their willingness to tell us when we're wrong. We're knocking on the doors, but we're knocking on the wrong doors. You know, if it wasn't for the resources and the information and the staff at um, SBE, we wouldn't know where to look for it. We wouldn't know that we're going to the wrong places. So I know for me, information, you know, is the, uh, the biggest resource. So we don't just leave our businesses out there when they become an SBE with us. We support them with small business, Development Center Services. We have consultants that actually work with those businesses. We're becoming more informed, more empathetic, more intelligent as leaders in public service. And it benefits the organization in that way, which benefits the whole community. That's, that's really what everybody wants, is for us to, to come together, learn together, be better. I think it's beneficial to be part of the SBE Collaborative because we get to look at it from a lot of different perspectives, sharing the knowledge that each group has. Now what does this mean to us? That means new jobs. That means being able to pay college tuition, being able to go to the grocery store, to pay your mortgage. We're making sure that we are a part of the economy and we are creating opportunities for our small businesses to be successful here in Pinellas County.